Yes. <laughs> O oh, great spirit, we come before you today to ask you to bless this young man and this young woman. For today they journey, as I said earlier, down the path of marriage. And on this journey, they promise to love, cherish, and to watch over each other in times of good and bad. As they journey in life, of giving, sharing, and supporting each other, some things will change. We'll use one today. Today, you two bring families and you make them one. And what I mean by that is your family becomes your family. Your family becomes your family. But one thing I need you all to remember, this is very important, you two to remember, Always allow each other to have that individual spirit of developing your new lives. Today, our family and friends, along with Crick and myself, we're here to celebrate this journey and union of marriage, and we are privileged to witness two dear friends, two exceptional and driven individuals commit to sharing their lives. So, to make this ceremony, like I said, as short as we can, I ask you two to face each other for the first time. Okay, at this time, I'm going to ask these two particular questions. I say to you, young man, do you have something to say to this young lady? You have anything to give him? Or shall Marcello? Marcello? Wait a minute. Why am I Oh, they got you all scheduled. Go on work first. <laughs> young lady, is there something you'd like to say to this young man? When in you I have found home, and I promise to love you fully and be faithful to you, to look after you, and to make you my number one priority. I love you. There's something you'd like to give him. Marshall. <laughs> okay, folks, with the ceremony we just did here, in the native way, they would be most likely given food. He would give her meat. She would give him corn to reassure each other that they will take care of each other no matter what happens, but in this case, they did the rings, which is beautiful. Okay, here's the important stuff now. With these words of blessings that were given today, I say to both of you, with the authority given to me by the state of Colorado and the great spirit, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.